Hi we're Let's Go Now Adventures and thank you for watching the Camping Knot series where we want to give you the skills and confidence to make your camping experience that much better. Hi, do you ever find yourself in a situation where you wish your rope was just a little bit longer? Well in today's video we're going to be covering the sheet bend. The sheet bend's an easy knot to tie and untie. It's just a simple, just a little wrap around and you've got a sheet bend. Well for our camping purposes, we're going to be connecting two ropes together using the sheet bend. Now where do you use this camping? Well I use it to connect a guy line from a tent or an awning and I use it to maybe put a piece of paracord with to extend that guy line out maybe another 20 feet. It's awesome in windy conditions where you can take that guy line out and stake it down a little bit further out or send a second guy line out to a tree. Now it's an easy knot to untie but where the sheep end shines is that it's good for connecting ropes but it's great for connecting ropes of different sizes together and because it's so easy to tie and untie it's fast and it's secure. So the way to tie it is we're going to go underneath and we're going to bring our working end off in the same direction so the tails start the same way. We'll take our um, working end underneath the loop. So we've gone under, over, under, over as we go over and then back under the working end. So you can see all we've done is a lot of over, under, over, under, over, under type things. And we'll just dress that knot by pulling it tight. And there we go. We now have a very secure sheet bend. One advantage of the sheet bend is that you can tie ropes of different diameter together and have a strong bend, a strong knot. So what we're going to use here is this um, rope. The blue one is much thicker diameter than this yellow paracord. So we're going to tie the knot the same way. We'll just come up underneath. We'll take our tail off to the same side and we'll go under, over, under, and then we'll set our knot. And there is a sheet bend with two different diameters. That's a strong knot. Now there we go. That's tightened and that's going to hold up under most circumstances. So if you're camping today, there's a really good chance that you're going to be tying the sheet bend with synthetic ropes. One disadvantage of a synthetic rope is it's slipperier than its natural fiber counterparts. So the way we fix this problem is we tie a double sheet bend. Now the double sheet bend is very similar to the sheet bend in that um, we start it the same way. So we'll go under the loop, come out, the tail's going to go the same way. But what we want to do is grab just a little bit more tail. So what we'll do is that we'll tie it exactly like we did the first sheet bend. We'll go under one time. We'll go over the loop, under the working end. Okay? That's the regular sheet bend. What we're going to do now though to make it a double is, yes, we're going to go around a second time. So we'll go around, we'll go over the loop one more time, underneath the working end, back over the loop, and that is what the double sheet bend looks like before we've dressed it. Now what we want to do is just as we work that together, we'll pull that around, tighten that up so that we make sure that it tightens the right way before we put a, a lot of load on it. But now you can see that as I, as I tighten that, that that's a very secure knot. That's the double sheet bend. So you'll know when you've tied your sheet bend correctly because both tails will be coming out the same side of the knot and your working rope, the one that you actually did all the work with while you tied the knot, one will be coming out from underneath the loop, the other will be coming out from over the loop, and there you have a double sheet bend, two different diameter ropes that's very secure. So thank you for watching the video today. I think you'll find that the sheet bend knot is a great knot to have in your camping toolbox. So if you like the video, give it a great big thumbs up and make sure you hit the little subscribe button so you're notified when we release other videos. From Let's Go Now Adventures, I'm John and for Holly, have a great day and we'll see you on the next adventure.